unique about the balance, Marvel Television is so good at planting seeds for future storytelling, but also focusing on the present. What was that balance like for Daredevil? Well, I, it, what, the best part about being at Netflix was the fact that we already knew where we were going. So it, it, there's a, a number of things that we got that we couldn't get anywhere else, which was, it, you know, not only we were telling, we knew exactly how long the story was going to be, that we had a 13-hour story to tell. From as a storyteller, it really does allow you to be able to do specific things. You know where things are going to land, when you're going to have your villain come in, those kinds of things along the way. So that part is really exciting. So while we were making the show, we had that going on. But we also knew, and this started from the very beginning, when we first sat down with Netflix, it was the partnership was not just to make one show. It was to make four shows so that we knew we were going to go to Jessica Jones and then from there to go to Luke Cage and then from there to go to Iron Fist and then eventually get to that place which is the Defenders. We had a great model from our motion picture division in that they had made Iron Man, they had made Hulk, they had made Thor, they made Captain America and then they made the Avengers. So Netflix could at least see that Marvel had done it before and had had great success at it, but no one had ever done it in the history of television. And for them to make that kind of commitment and for us to be able to deliver on that commitment, I think is the part that's so exciting.